Morgana. Dude, that was so good. So sad. Yeah. The power of friendship did it. The Metanev. It's gone. The Mentos must have disappeared too. We can't see Mona anymore. Rough. Can we? Who knows? It's fine. I already know the answer. What are y'all so gloomy for? Mona would laugh at us for it. Wow. Dude, thank you very much for the sub. Oh my god. I just beat the final boss of, you know, main game. So, yeah, now it's like big story time. Me. And what about the public? Were we able to change their hearts? How we doing, man? I'm gonna be late for my date! All alone on Christmas, huh? It's kinda hard to tell. Aren't we going into the new year without a prime minister? Will this country be alright? We'll be fine. <laughs> but there's no way we're getting Shido. There are tons of shady rumors about him, you know? I wonder how things oh, will go. They finally fucking believed it. I hope they go well. Let's believe in the adults. Sis promised us, after all. From here on out, it's the prosecutor's job, huh? If we can't enter the metaverse, that means we've been relieved of being phantom thieves. It feels yeah! a bit sad. What did I just say? We gotta stop being so gloomy. Think about that insane ass we just killed. It is Matt Mercer. You were right. We should be celebrating with a victory toast. Well, we're still high schoolers, so we can't really drink a real toast. Oh, what if we tried something else? Like, what do athletes do after a win? You mean a huddle? We could all circle up and give a victory shout together. Sounds good. <laughs> Except for the part where we're it in is. the center of Shibuya, surrounded by tons of people. What? You want to do it here and now? Come on, Ryuji, get with the program. I too am disappointed. After all we've been through together, you've nothing left to lose with this. Hey, speak for yourself. I've got tons of shit I could lose. Fine, let's get this over with. Everyone, put your hands in. Don't you think this is a little too overt? No. Yeah, uh, can we hurry this up? I don't mind yelling so long as we make it quick. Oh, Woohoo! Celebration is going great. <sighs> Whatever. Joker. You lead off with this. Got it. Hmm. It would only feel natural for you to take the charge. That's right, Yusuke. When he gives our victory cry, we all follow with a super loud, yeah! Got it? All right. One, two. We captured your hearts! Yeah! yeah. <sighs> that actually made me feel a bit better. It's like everything's finally over. I want to check out Outriders. It does look really good. I'm not sure what it is or uh, you know how I'm going to how it's going to be played, but it looks really cool. You may be right there. The more I think about it, the more pressure I realize we were really under. I hope we can relax at least a little now. Ugh, it's chilly. That is until we got to deal with Maruki baby. No wonder it's cold. Is this what they call a white Christmas? Nope, it's Christmas Eve. It's on Christmas Eve. Thanks, Makoto. Christmas. I completely forgot about it. Anyhow, we'll have to see what happens for now. We should probably break for today. Let's meet at LeBlanc tomorrow. LeBlanc. Have a final meeting on the situation. LeBlanc. Yeah, let's do that. <sighs> hey. It'll be Christmas, so why don't we do a last celebration party? Okay. I like the sound of that. There better not be anyone that's got plans already. It's settled then. Make sure you persuade Boss to let us reserve the store for the party. Sure thing. We will be counting on you. Well then, see you all again. As always. I'm worried about Sojiro, so I'm gonna head home. Dude, Sojiro was pumped. What are you talking about? <sighs> we should go home too. Whoa! Oh. Huh. 
138 hours I've spent with these characters. I didn't expect to find the world savior alone on Christmas Eve. I'm not. I'm with like Can super hot me? chick, dude. First off, thank you for taking my request. With your actions, I can only hope that public opinion changes. It will change, won't it? Yeah. I'm sure it will. I believe so too. Shido confessed to a variety of crimes. We can arrest him on those charges. The problem lies in proving him guilty. It'd be difficult unless the correlation between the metaverse and the mental shutdowns is made. I'll be blunt. I want you to turn yourself in to the police. Why? Your testimony will be necessary in order to prove Shido guilty. However, that will mean placing you on center stage. You'll be treated as a hero who saved this country. But you're going to There's jail. There's no way that the police or the public prosecutors will let that slide. If you turn yourself into kind of. police, you'll definitely be arrested. What? I'll close all the cases surrounding Shido. I intend to expose them all. I'd rather Just not. To prevent society from becoming distorted again. That's what you want too, isn't it? It's Persona Ace Attorney. Sounds like my testimony is necessary for them to find Shido guilty. There's no knowing what the police would do. They'd never let a phantom thief be the hero. If I take the stand and testify about Shido's crimes, everything can be taken care of. But before that... I'll ask you once more. I'd like for you to turn yourself into the police. Of your own accord. <laughs> There's no need for that. <gasps> oh! Oh! You. He's back! If they get their hands on the perpetrator, there'll be no need for him to turn himself in, no? What the fuck? To see you so surprised. Honestly, it's pretty satisfying. <laughs> you said there's no need. Oh. Just what do you mean by that? My god. Exactly as it sounds. He's turning. Oh. I'll agree to testify against Shido and his crimes. Aw, a catchy. I assume that works for you. Dude. What are you scheming, you fuck stick? You're overthinking this. I have no hidden agenda at this point. Why are you alive? If I had to explain myself, I'd say it's simply personal principle that I repay my debts. Fair enough, Akechi. For the time being, rock least, on, dude. I'll take your Hell yeah. You'll cooperate with the investigation. He, he's had a hidden agenda all game. Save a lot of time. But I'm we sorry. killed him, kind of. Forget everything I just told you. I'll take him in myself. Then his character killed. Then he killed himself. I won't it was weird. Claim that everything <gasps> will turn out perfectly Whoa, for you. that's dark, dude. But I would bet this case will reach its natural conclusion. No. In fact, I swear that this will be properly settled. Shido and the masses have undergone a change of heart, and the case is headed toward its resolution. This must be how things were supposed to happen. <laughs> Cute! Who do I hang out with? My girl friend. When you're, used to when you're used to hospital hours, Christmas never means much. But I figured you'd want to do something as a couple. We can spend Christmas Eve together, if you want. Dude, yeah, spend time with Takumi, dude. <laughs> the only girl friend in here. Thanks, that's what I wanted to hear. Let's cl I'll close up for today. Let's meet somewhere in the city. Should head to our meeting place. I don't know where our meeting place is. If I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> What a crowd. It's okay. Anyway, thanks for coming. Were you hoping to see me today? Dude. I want to see you every day. Aren't you straight? Bang, forward? bang, bang. Boy. Well then, I can be honest too. I'm glad to hear it. Hell yeah. So what happens after this? Me? You? <laughs> Sex. If you don't have anything in mind, we can go out to eat. Don't worry. No experiments today. We can eat too. That's fine. I wasn't really thinking about sex anyway. At all. Cool. Let's go. 
Oh, uh, but first? One, because he's a young guy. Underage, baby. This usually isn't my style, but it's Christmas, so... Would you like to hold hands? Cute. Let's do it. Jeez, ah. Christmas Eve yeah. really clogs this place up. But I know, like I said, I've said before many times, she can step on me. Didn't think all the restaurants would be totally booked. It's fine, I've got you. Where do you learn these lines? <laughs> Cake first, though, right? Once we've got that, you can feed me all the cheesy schlock you want. Let's go look for one. I wouldn't get your hopes up. I can afford that, dude. I have like $4 million. You wouldn't happen to have any Christmas cakes left, would you? Actually, we do. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> here's a here's a cordial invitation for you to sit on my face. <laughs> One of our orders was canceled last minute. That's fucked this up. Is the only cake we have. Well, in that case, we'd like to buy it. Of course. Just wait one moment while I go prepare your order. That'll be thirty-five million yen. Can you believe that? I can hardly wait. Slow down. <laughs> what? That's just so rude, soon. dude. Just the two of us. Just the two of us. Dude! Yeah! I have been faithful this whole game, dude. Mm, that's good. <laughs> 600 second timeout? That's so mean. Maybe we should do this more often. Yes. Well, yeah, we're dating, right? In the game, we're dating, right? How about you? Having fun? Can I do another cheesy line? This is the best. Wow. I didn't know you were so worked up about it. Always. Well, maybe I can make this a little more exciting. I got a muffler. All right. Here's your present. Not handmade or anything, okay? Just so you know, this wasn't some huge labor of love. You can be pretty sweet sometimes. Um, part dating sim, part RPG, part fight god, um, part high school sim, part judge sim, I mean, <laughs> court simulator. It's so many things. Be good. Hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Muting me on this. The month of women's history. Got a chill down your spine? Yeah. You had cream on your nose. No, it's no not. Idea how it got there, but she's she's uh she's the nurse, dude. She's like 25 or something. I'm as underage. As your other identity goes, I figure it's not my business. But as long as we're making this work somehow, I might as well say this. I can at least tell how much you and the other phantom thieves go through to save people. You can? I am your girlfriend after all. Um, Futaba, she's around. I just wanted to acknowledge that it's thanks to those efforts that I found my own calling. Never. <laughs> I really am glad I've got you. Aw. Was all you, baby. Take a compliment for once. Still, I gotta say, you've got some weird taste. I do. People talk. But what it comes down to is that the Phantom Thieves are these big modern heroes, right? Damn right. Never really thought of myself as girlfriend material, let alone for a hero. You're the only one I want. <laughs> all right already. You're the one that I want. Bring it down a notch, smooth talker. 
Who are you trying to impress? Me? Oh, you knew that? Sorry, sorry, okay. Heath Ledger almost broke Jake Gyllenhaal's nose by grabbing his head and kissing him too hard in Brokeback Mountain. Oh, look. It's really coming down out there. Yeah, it is. I never fell for this stuff. Oh, the snowfall, the romance. I'm not exactly the swooning type. Didn't think I was, anyway. Jeez. I'm supposed to be the adult here, but you're the one who keeps supporting me. Highlighted. Fuck you. <laughs> I've never been happy. <gasps> oh, she's never been happier. How about you? It's good, right? I feel like I'm going to wake up any second now and all this will be gone. Oh, this is kind of adorable. <laughs> oh, it's not a dream. Oh, this is real. <laughs> you're right. Maybe everything can just be nice for once. Good old Brokeback Mountain, dude. That movie's actually pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. Hey, I don't know if I should be going home in all that snow. You get what I'm saying, right? No, what do you mean? Do you want to sleep on the couch? Gameplay recording, recording pause because I entered a block scene. <laughs> a catchy did what? Yeah. He turned himself into the police. It's Christmas. He just told me yesterday. It's Christmas. He's admitted to being the perpetrator behind the recent cases. <laughs> he's doing the right thing. So he's alive. Yeah. Weird. Akechi kun survived and owned up to what he did. Akechi kun did. <laughs> okay. Uh, Fritz Lang's Metropolis was reportedly one of Adolf Hitler's favorite films. Why did I need to know that? Well, I feel it's for the best. If Akechi-kun is alive, and he can atone for his crimes, that's not a bad turn of events. Right. Ain't that all stuff to be happy about? Mm-hmm. It's Christmas. We should enjoy the day to our heart's content. I approve. Let everyone be merry to the max. I'm the one who should be giving permission, you know. It's cool. We can, we can um, talk about how the Lord of the Rings: Return of the King won all eleven Academy Awards it was nominated for. Well, as long as you don't go overboard, I guess you can go ahead and cut loose today. Yeah, so Jiro, don't tell me what to do, dog. Oh yeah, there's uh, there's Futaba by the way, right above the Sojiro tag, right there. He didn't hear a word of that. He didn't. <sighs> Fine. Food! Oh my. This is quite a sight. You do know of this character. I'm going to be entirely honest. I wasn't able to bring a dish. Did you know Viggo Mortensen broke his foot when he kicked uh, during like the pile orc scene? He kicked it and he screamed because he did break his foot. Instead, leave the dishwashing duties to me. I'll make sure they turn out beautifully immaculate. Shut the fuck up, Yusuke. Hmm. Why don't we all just clean up together? So, who brought what? No, Matt Mercer does not try and hide his voice. I brought that marinated seafood. He always talks like this. Mmm, oh, that's super good. And him and his beautiful long hair and his crazy good voice. It may not be to everyone. 
everyone's tastes. But I brought that cheese plate. <laughs> Is that D and Daddy? <laughs> It's cheese, dude. Oh. <laughs> it also it's tastes great. like dirty socks. Ah, thank goodness. Oh, is this a croque and bouche? It's so cute. All right. If you didn't know how to freaking pronounce that, say it right now. Your mother <laughs> is it now? It's a shocker, right? I made that all by myself. All I did was buy some cream puffs and stack them up, though. It's been arranged so artistically that I hesitate to sample it. When it comes to sweets, on truly has us beat. On truly has us beat. But then, who brought this box over here? Ooh, this looks like more sweets. John Cena. Anyway. Uh. Me, kind of. Ryuji brought sweets. Ryuji? Ryuji and sweets. Aw, oh, Ryuji, sweet boy. Sweets. Hey, what are you guys getting at? It was just a bit unexpected is all. I had expected something along the lines of meat. For some reason, chicken comes to mind when I think of you. Dude, Ryuji doesn't always just sling meat, bro. Ryuji, chicken. That's her. That that's the that's the girl uh, Daniel was like kind of like all uh, all about. Um, I'm sorry. I didn't mean that in any sort of comparative way. Please don't keep going. It just hurts even more. Cheer up. Did you hear what I just said? Shut the fuck up. Smack him. Come on, don't get all depressed. Everyone's here to party. All right, all right. Here's a here's a um, here's a good fact that I didn't know. Orson Welles voiced Unicron in the Transformers movie, his penultimate film role. Everyone. Oh. Mona -chan. Fuck yeah, dude. I was trying. I to love that movie. It, but it's hard to avoid. That was one of my favorite movies as a kid. Got really quiet in there. If only Mona could be here with us. Mona's gonna show up, right? Someone call for me? Yeah, we were just talking about. Huh? Wait, what? No way! I thought you disappeared! Looks like the only me that disappeared was the one in the metaverse. Ba -ba -ba -ba. So, you stayed in reality as a cat? When I woke up, I was out in Shibuya looking like this. I headed back here right away, but it took a surprising amount of time. Oh, they, they just turned Morgana into a kitty on here. In the on her animation, her little face there. It's great. I love it. We're coming back here. You should have told us, moron. I know, right? We were so worried. Jeez. Well, I brought my own surprise back too. Oh, now there's our chief for you. Talk about everything falling into place. Come on, let's get started. We're gonna party to celebrate our hard work and my grand return. Don't push your luck. Yeah. <laughs> Why do you have to? Oh, Things are finally back to normal. Thank goodness. 
Now everyone really is here. <laughs> Greatest Christmas ever. Aw, cute. Aw, that's adorable. And Morgana's back too. I'm so glad. Gosh, I think I'm tearing up again. Hey! Lady Han. I'm glad to be back too. Sounds like he's glad too. Here's a pic for you, Mona. A nice little post party snapshot. Aww. That's adorable! Aha! A splendid picture. Yes, yeah, somehow seeing them together puts me at ease. You and him are pretty close by now, huh, Davy? Oh, he's family. Nice. Family, huh? So I'm basically your older brother, right? Anyway, don't go disappearing again, got it? I don't want to worry about you like that anymore. Futaba. That's right, tonight's supposed to be a celebration. I'm glad I could be a part of it. I know I already said it, but thanks everyone. I'm glad I got to come back to you. Aw, so sweet. So sweet. Yes, I sure would like to save my progress. We're down to only one day left of the year. I know it's sudden, but we're gonna throw a year-end party tomorrow. Kick ass! Are you organizing this, Futaba-chan? Thank you for letting us know. Sojourer is making New Year's Eve soba noodles for us. In that case, would it be alright if we met up in the evening? May I invite my sister? Go ahead, the whole place is reserved anyway. And should we call Yoshizawa too? Morgana and Futaba already covered it, but she really helped out helped him out in that palace before. And it's New Year's Eve, so it's not like she'll be busy at practice. I agree. And Davy, you're officially our event coordinator. It's your job to contact her. She'll be thrilled. All right, see you tomorrow. A year-end party, huh? I'm already excited. Oh, let's invite Yoshizawa right away. All right. Thank you for inviting me. Although, I admit, I feel a bit like I'm intruding. Why? There's no need for modesty. After all we've been through, there are no strangers here. That's a fucking beautiful scarf there, Yusuke. Yeah. You really helped him out, too. In that case, I'll accept your offer. Fair enough. Yo, I really can't stop staring at that thing you're wearing. <laughs> so it's caught your eye as well. It happened to catch mine while I was strolling through the city. I bought it for myself as a reward for the end of the year. What do you think about the scarf? It's pretty nice. It looks great on you, Yusuke. Thank you. Your compliment is music to my ears. And your music is compliment to my ears. I don't think anyone other than you could pull it off, Kitagawa Senpai. Kitagawa, right? Should be Kitagawa. <laughs> this fashion chat is fine and all, but if you don't dig into that soba soon, it's going to get soggy on you. Ah, uh, yes. My apologies. Thank you for the food. Been told that before. It's chow time. Ah. Mm, so good. Sakura-san, you made these noodles yourself, right? They're amazing. You could open a soba restaurant. Oh, thanks. I made a little too much, so if anyone wants a refill... Seconds, please. How fast do you eat? You eat a lot more than I'd assumed you do, Yoshizawa-san. Yeah, she eats a fuck ton. Her stomach's bottomless. Seriously? While being that thin? Senpai, don't kid them so much. <laughs> My appetite's totally normal. Breaking news on our top story. Not true. 
After nearly two weeks of silence, the prosecutor's office is planning to move forward with the biggest case of the year. They have announced that they will move forward in the charging of Representative Sheeta. It's finally happening. Sorry. I was planning on telling all of you about this a little later. This case is all thanks to a certain man's testimony. A catchy coon. But I can at least share this one piece of good news with you. <gasps> and that would be... He wants to punch a baby. The woman involved in his false charge case has finally come forward and provided her testimony. <gasps> I can't say for certain yet. But his criminal record may very well be overturned. For real? Yay! Then that's wonderful. It is wonderful. Congratulations, Senpai. Of course, this is highly confidential. Got it? Confidential. What great news. Looks like we really will be having a happy new year. This is incredible. It's an actual real life good ending. And after that, the two-hour New Year's special of Tokyo Vice. <gasps> Tokyo Vice! A thrilling tale jam-packed with some of the network's most famous faces. I'll never give up! I've been seeing this guy on TV all the time lately. Who's this? Oh, yeah. He's a model-turned-actor. <laughs> I'm actor. With a figure like that, I can see how he's gotten so popular. Yeah. So he's popular, eh? If I were more like that human... Maybe Lady Anne would... The year is winding down to its final moments. Let's take a look at how people are spending it all across the country. Okay. Now that I'm thinking about it, hell of a lot sure did happen this year. Right? It's like, how many years of our lives did we actually live through this year? I doubt we'll experience anything even similar to it for quite some time. Well, this is just from my point of view, but I really hope that's the case. <laughs> and I guess starting next year, we'll just be good boys and girls at school. If that's the case, then I assume you'll be able to handle your summer break homework on your own, right? Mm -hmm. Please don't go there, senpai. <laughs> I don't think I see that. Happening. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> fine. <laughs> you can't do it alone. I mean, what do you do as an student? <sighs> So much has happened over the past 12 months, but in the end, we got to spend it together like this. I want to believe that this was a great year for us. Yeah, I don't have any proof, but I feel like next year is going to be even better for us. I feel the exact same way. How strange. Well, that's only natural, considering how pleased we are with our end of year celebration. Young people have been gathering in Shibuya all day for the big countdown at midnight. And this crowd is... FIRE! I really don't want to get going, but it seems like it's time. See you next year, right? Ah. Next year? <gasps> Sojiro, Osechi time! Get those New Year's dishes ready! Chop chop! And don't forget the black beans! Yeah, don't forget the black beans, dude. Yeah, yeah I hear ya. If I start prepping the beans now, they'll be ready by the morning. Don't worry about the food. You just go have a good night's sleep. Word. Happy New Year! No oh, shit, it's already the New Year. Let's make it a good one. Last year's end seems only yesterday. Should we get together for a party or something? We gotta celebrate somehow. You have something in mind? I don't know, like a mochi eating contest or something? A prospect absolutely devoid of any class or dignity. I don't know what we do, but I'm totally down to see you all. Same. Not tomorrow. I get plans. Me too. Apologies. But any other time should be fine. Sure, we can pick a date later. Anyways, Happy New Year. We're gonna have a great one, guys. Mm, hey, don't tell this to the others, okay? But even after I disappeared, I was still vaguely conscious. And being separated from all of you was really scary. No. I thought if it's even a little bit possible. I wanted to come home to you guys. Say, Morgana. That's why I'm so glad I was able to come back here. Welcome home. Yeah. Thanks. Well, it's pretty late. Let's get to sleep. 
I know I've said this before, but I hope we keep sticking together like this. Uh, excuse you? Maruki's fucking counselor office. Fuck yeah, I fucking called it. I fucking knew it was Maruki. I get the feeling that I need to go home. The straight up Maruki. I know it's Maruki. This looks like the school. I need to go home. I can hear her voice. Who is it? It's Ryuji. I know it's Ryuji. That's a butterfly! It's Persona 4! What? I can't I can't really chase anything. What the fuck is happening? My sister's been supporting the family. It's unrealistic to demand any more. Dude. I'm helping Okumura for his grab with my father watching over me. Are we playing Persona 4 now? <laughs> what the fuck is going on? Where are you going? I'm going home. Home? But isn't this where you belong? I see. So you still haven't accepted it. Well, I won't force you into anything. Let's meet again. I feel like I had the most bizarre dream. What could it have meant? <laughs> 